The ways cats communicate with us are so subtle that we often miss the memo entirely. Have you ever noticed your cat staring intently at you before letting out a big yawn? Or perhaps they've rolled over to show you their belly, or even more baffling, knocked something off the table right in front of you. In these actions, and many more, your kitty is trying to convey something quite important. But what could it be? Today, we're on a mission to decode these mysterious messages. And before we dive in, be sure to subscribe to our channel and join our feline-loving community. Why does your cat yawn at you? Firstly, cats yawn for some of the same reasons we do. They're tired or they're transitioning from one state of alertness to another. But also when they yawn at you, they are basically saying, Hey, look at me! Cats are smart. They know that a yawn can catch your attention. So if dinner is late or they just want a bit of playtime, a yawn might be their way of communicating with you. Additionally, some researchers believe that when a cat yawns after you do, it's a sign of empathy. Just like humans, cats might be capable of catching yawns. This theory suggests that cats, through domestication and living closely with humans, have developed a form of empathy towards us. They see us yawn and they mirror it, not because they're tired, but because they're connected to us on an emotional level. On the flip side, a cat yawn can also be a sign of stress or irritation. This can happen in situations where they're faced with something or someone they're not fond of. Why does your cat show you their belly? The belly of a cat is their most vulnerable area. By exposing it, they're showing a high level of trust and comfort around you. It's a significant gesture considering the solitary and cautious nature of cats. However, before you dive in for a belly rub, be aware that not all cats enjoy having their belly touched. Another reason a cat might show you their belly is to cool down. On a hot day, you might find your cat sprawled out on their back. The fur on their belly is typically thinner, making it a perfect spot to release excess heat. But sometimes, a cat showing their belly is preparing for defense. In this posture, they can use all four sets of claws and even their teeth if they feel threatened. This defensive stance is often misunderstood by humans as an invitation for interaction. Interestingly, in a multi-pet household, this behavior can also be a way of demonstrating social status among pets. It's as if they're saying, I'm comfortable enough to expose my belly, and I trust you won't attack me. Now here's a fascinating piece of research. Studies have shown that cats are more likely to expose their belly to owners they've bonded with strongly. This behavior is less commonly displayed towards strangers or individuals with whom they share a less significant relationship. Why does your cat stretch when seeing you? Stretching helps cats to loosen up their muscles after a nap. Stretching gets their blood flowing and prepares them for the activities ahead, whether it's playing, exploring, or more sleeping. But there's also a deeper social aspect to it. In the wild, Cats stretch as a way of demonstrating trust and vulnerability. By stretching in front of you, they're showing that they trust you enough to let their guard down. It's a big compliment from a cat. Moreover, this behavior is a part of their greeting ritual. Cats have various ways of greeting their friends, including head bumps, gentle bites, or even bringing you gifts. Stretching is part of this friendly behavior a non-verbal way of saying, I'm glad you're here. Interestingly, cats also stretch to release endorphins, which are chemicals in the brain that increase feelings of well-being and happiness. So when your cat stretches in front of you, they're not only preparing for the day, but also feeling pretty good about it. And seeing you is part of that good feeling. Why does your cat deliberately knock things over? Have you ever placed something on a table only to find your cat pushing it off the edge? If you think they're doing it just to test gravity or your patience, you're only partly right. First off, let's talk about their need for stimulation. Cats are naturally curious creatures with sharp hunting instincts. When they're indoors, those instincts don't just disappear. 
So, that pen on your desk or the vase on your shelf? To them, it's prey that needs to be pounced on. By knocking things over, they're engaging with their environment, keeping those predatory skills sharp. Cats are also master communicators, and knocking things over is a surefire way to grab your attention. Whether it's a silent plea for food, playtime, or just a bit of affection, they've learned that this action gets a reaction out of you. And let's be honest, it works every time. It might not always be the reaction they were hoping for, but it does the job of breaking your focus from whatever you were doing to attend to them. Sometimes, a cat knocking things over can be a form of protest or expression of displeasure. Changes in their environment, like a new pet, a new home, or even rearranging furniture can upset them. It's their form of control over a situation that they're not entirely comfortable with. Interestingly, this behavior is not just random. Studies have shown that cats might choose specific objects that elicit a stronger reaction from you or items that make interesting sounds. Why does your cat bite your hand? Cats use their mouths to explore the world, especially kittens. When they gently bite your hand, it's often part of their play behavior, mimicking the actions they would use in hunting. This playful biting is a sign they are comfortable with you and see you as part of their social group. But why do some bites seem more intense or come out of nowhere? Cats have a threshold for petting and attention, known as petting-induced aggression. When the petting goes beyond their comfort level, they might bite your hand to communicate. That's enough. Another intriguing aspect is the behavior of cats that were weaned too early. These cats may exhibit more frequent or intense biting as adults. Early weaning can lead to a higher reliance on their mouths for interaction, as they missed out on the crucial learning phase of bite inhibition from their mother and litter mates. Why does your cat sleep with you? First off, cats seek comfort and security when they choose their sleeping spots. Your bed, with its soft pillows and blankets, is not just comfortable, but also smells like you, which can be very reassuring to them. In the wild, cats are most vulnerable when they're asleep, so choosing to sleep by your side is a significant sign of their confidence in your protection. Then there's the undeniable fact that cats love warmth. Humans naturally give off heat, and by snuggling close to you, cats can keep warm and cozy throughout the night. It's a practical choice, especially on colder nights. But it's not just about warmth and comfort, it's also about bonding. Cats bond with their family members on their own terms, and sleeping together is a quiet yet powerful way of strengthening that bond. Interestingly, studies have shown that sleeping with a cat can actually benefit humans too. The presence of a cat can reduce stress and anxiety, providing a calming effect that leads to a better night's sleep for some people. It's like having a living, purring, warmth-emitting stress relief tool right in your bed. Why does your cat spring on your feet? Ever noticed how your cat seems to have a sudden burst of energy launching themselves at your unsuspecting feet? First off, this behavior is a direct reflection of their predatory instincts. In the wild, a cat's survival depends on their ability to hunt and those moving feet? Well, to them, they closely resemble the movements of prey animals. This instinct is so strong that even the domesticated purr machine lounging on your sofa can't resist the urge to pounce. It's their way of engaging with you, inviting you into a game, albeit a somewhat painful one at times. They could also be trying to grab your attention this way. This ambush on your feet could be their way of reminding you that they're there and they need some interaction or playtime. Scientists have recognized 10 behaviors cats exhibit when they consider you part of their inner circle. So check out this video to find out what they are, and be sure to subscribe to our channel and join our feline-loving community.